actually saw him fight here before at Warrior Promotions, July 10th. Um, he has seven fights, uh, six losses, and one decision. He's coming off of a, of a three, I believe, um, a two-fight losing streak, as one decision was before then. Um, you know, he didn't make it out of the first round, the first to last time I saw him fight back in July. So, um, to be honest, he didn't leave a super strong impression then, but every day is new. Let's see what he brings to the table today. And now, and ready to make his, his way to the ring from the red corner, Jesus Abla! Obviously, he's a hometown favorite. Jesus, yeah. Yeah, his... Super lightweight. This is a super lightweight fight. Big turnout for this debut from by Jesus Abon from Venezuela. The crowd is all for him. We have Venezuelan flat. Here from comes Jesus Abon, looking good. From Caracas, Venezuela. His debut, the crowd behind him. And obviously, Glenn Johnson seems to be in this corner, so he he's, uh, looks to be serious here. So He's got a nice, shiny outfit at the very least. a beautiful outfit. Let's just see how he uses, uh, how the trunks move around. Uh, he's 5'9". His opponent's a very lanky kid. Um, I don't have to hide on him here, but he looks like every bit of like six feet tall. Very lanky, skinny, thin kid. Got the uh, young Tammy Hearns look. Without the record. Ladies and gentlemen so from the Miami Airport, Airport Convention Center in Miami, Florida, yeah, our next so battle of the evening is brought to you by World Warrior Promotions in association with Majority.com. All in one, mobile banking for migrants. So tell Save, me. send, speak. He's all going to rub the rounds. He's all sister wise. He's got the four rounds. A professional boxing is reached here. Welter Wild Division. Uh, he has the three judges scoring at ringside. Now look at this one. Frank Diaz, Frank Dillig, and Rocky Young. When the bell rings, the man in charge of the action will referee Sam Burgos. My color commentator. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, wearing the black trunks with the white trim. He weighed in at 140 pounds. A veteran of six professional bouts from Wilson, North Carolina. Here is Juvali, baby two-time Alden. His opponent fighting out of the red corner, wearing the gold trunks with the blue, red, and silver trim. He weighed in at 139 and a half pounds. Tonight, he is making his professional debut. Elio de Caracas, Venezuela, y Cuple Bay, Florida. rooting for him tonight. Come on. Ralph calls the prospective corners and her trainers to the middle of the ring. See Glenn Johnson, the road right. warrior, Come here. who's finally not on the road right, anymore. Take the instructions in the back, obey my command, protect yourself at all times. Right here is good, right here Johnson is good. Johnson in his corner and the whole crowd back like him. Out of the belt. Yeah, it's going to be a, a rough night for uh, Mr. Artis, but you never know. You never know. Came all the way from North Carolina, 22-year-old kid. Let's see what we got. And they're off. Okay, he comes out southpaw. Out of start. Moves around pretty good. Okay. He is. Holding, 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 holding. Well, he's coming out firing in his debut here. Oh, yeah, he's got to make an impression. His first fight, big amateur career. He's got a hometown crowd. Uh, he needs a knockout. 
At 5'9", he's definitely the shorter guy. Nice body shot. Beautiful body shot that he felt. Aldis felt that shot. Oh, he's trying to hold for dear life as well as should. He just got pushed out of the ring by Jesus Alban. And uh, he unfolded himself is slowly getting up. I don't think he's hurt. It's just no, he's not hurt. Fall no, he's moving around pretty fine. good, but uh, Alban wants that knockout. He's got the home crowd. He's got, he's got the jets, got the very short, shorts, I mean. up and down, hands a little wider apart, very focused. He's using the jab well to keep distance. Beautiful very left nice. body shot. He's finding the openings very well. On it. It's attacking him on the well, ropes. And there you go. Know, takes the knee. Beats the eight count, he's up. He wants to continue. For how long, we don't know. Ref's gonna let it go on. Alban coming right back at him. He Keeping wants to stop It's going up and down, I like what I see. Artists getting loud. I think this is gonna be the end. Nice body shot. And that's the end again. of the fight and as he goes down. That's a great professional debut for Jesus Alba. It's a great debut, first round knockout, what he needed. And he looked good, he looked very good. He looked sharp, he moved well. Let's go. Like I told you, this fight it was gonna last long. Well, Mr. Artis is sitting down. He's not hurt, except for his ego. Uh, trying to make it a game, but completely unmatched. Zero, six, and one. Mr. Alban, amateur career from Venezuela. Top amateur prospect from Venezuela. Glenn Johnson in this corner. Got what he wanted, that first round knockout. What do you think, uh, Mr. Francesco? The opponent that was in, uh, you know, up to his level. I mean, the fight was already gone for the first round. You go tell that wasn't gonna last. As soon as the guy landed a couple of solid punches, the fight was over. I agree. He I was agree. Far better than the opponent. He used the jab very good to keep distance, get openings. He landed with a body shot. He was finding openings. He completely outclassed the opponent. A very, very promising start. He looks good. Yeah, very good, but he did what he had to do. Ladies and gentlemen, so let's have a nice round of applause for both Got fighters, please. Official announcement. Ladies and gentlemen, from the Miami Airport Convention Center in Miami, Florida, your referee in charge, Sam Burgos, calls a halt to the bout at 1 minute, 58 seconds of the first round. Your winner by TKO, now 1-0 as a professional, Jesus.